The legend of the vampire has been told for centuries, capturing the dark shadows of our imagination and inspiring filmmakers and actors to breathe new life into the undead. But there's never been a vampire like Barnabas Collins. What is this? Some specter approaches. Have at me, Lucifer. My soul is prepared. I'd always been sort of attracted to horror films and things like that, even as a very young kid. I said, Tim, we should do a vampire movie together. I could see right away that he had a, a passion for it. Nosferatu with Max Schreck was one of my favorites. Dracula, of course, with Bela Lugosi. Boris Karloff, Lon Chaney. Christopher Lee certainly is one of the greats. It was a real treat getting to work with Christopher. I mean, the guy's a legend. Barnabas Collins. Collins. Why does a Colin want to talk to me? One of my favorite moments I've ever been able to experience in a film was I got to hypnotize Dracula. I got to hypnotize Christopher Lee. Look into my eyes and deliver me your innermost thoughts. He was, you know, the great Dracula. <laughs> For Barnabas, everywhere I searched character-wise, I kept coming back to Jonathan Fred. He really did something beautiful with that character on the Dark Shadows series back in the 60s and early 70s. Have there been others like myself? No, you're the only one I've encountered. If you look closely during the ball, there's the original cast members from the show, including Jonathan Fred, the original Barnabas. They walk through the door as guests. Welcome to Colin Wood. There's great humor in it, but great humor that comes out of very serious issues. I simply seek advice on the art of courting a woman of this time. You obviously mean Vicky.